to my channel and also welcome back to another vlog. If you're new, super special welcome to you. My name is Alyssa Marie and I'm so happy and thankful that you're here. Happy Thanksgiving, you guys. I know by the time you see this, Thanksgiving will have already passed, but as of right now, right here, it is Thanksgiving. So I hope you guys are having an amazing start to like the holiday season. I made a decision to keep myself isolated this year for Thanksgiving. This is really my first Thanksgiving that is gonna look something like this. It, I'm sure this is true for a lot of other people as well. This year has been crazy, but I am determined to still make it a really great Thanksgiving, even though we're isolating. I wanna have fun, I wanna be festive. So we're gonna do all that and I'm gonna take y'all along for the ride. So let's go. All right, so here is what we have on the menu today. I'm gonna make some ham, I'm gonna make some stuffing, and then also some baked mac and cheese. I'm really, really excited. So I gotta say, this is really different for me. I'm usually the girl who kind of shows up with the booze and that's it. You need wine, you need me to bring tequila, like that's it, I'm your girl, I'm there. But I'm not usually the one to actually cook the Thanksgiving food, but we're trying things a little different this year, okay? So ham first, we need ham and we need cloves to start this out. Got my cutting board, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and take the ham out of this. So we're gonna carefully score the ham. I feel so out of my league right now, but you know what? This is how you get good at shit. You just do it, you try it, and then boom. Like, in a few years, I'm gonna be a master at this, and y'all gonna be watching my cooking vlogs like, girl! You know what, before I clove anymore, I think I'm actually going to cut off a chunk of ham for Hersh. All right, boom. These are gonna be for Hershey, lucky girl. All right, so once that's done, I'm now gonna transfer the ham over into the baking tray. Da, 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 and then it's ready to go inside. Hey, Hersh, you want a piece of ham? Sit, sit. Girl, do you want the ham? Good girl, paw, paw, good baby. Oh yeah, she likes it. <laughs> she likes it, you like it? There's more where that came from. Not yet though, it's not dinner time just yet. All right, so the ham has been in for, well it was supposed to be 30 minutes. It's been a little bit over, but it's fine. It's been in for 30 minutes, so I've gone ahead, taken it out, and now we're gonna add some little things to it. So I've got cherries, we've got pineapple slices, and toothpicks. All right, and then before we actually put the ham back in the oven, I'm gonna make a little ham sauce real quick. So my mom said to use like a little bit of the pineapple juice. I'm literally just eyeballing everything, so I don't know if this is enough or too little a little bit of the cherry juice, some brown sugar, and some honey. All right, so the ham is in. It's basically almost ready. It's, yeah, that's basically it for the ham. So now we're gonna go in and do this baked mac and cheese and stuffing. I'm so excited. It's gonna be pretty straightforward though, so I think I'm gonna kinda zoom past this part a little bit. But again, if you guys are really interested in seeing like full on recipes, let me know. If the interest is hot, I'll definitely come through for you guys on the blog. All right, and the last thing I always make sure to do is clean up the kitchen. It's just something that I personally have to do before I sit down and eat. This way I'll feel a lot more relaxed and just chill and I can literally just fully relax after I eat dinner and not have to worry about cleaning up the kitchen then. So this is always like a major, major step for me. I'm also gonna go ahead and clean off my makeup and also put my hair back. Like literally, I love to get into like full on 100% relaxation mode before I actually sit down to have dinner. All right, so here is the final result and we got Hershey's little stash of ham right there as well. 
I'm literally so proud of this. I know it looks like a little bit, but this actually took me a lot of effort and a lot of time, so I feel really proud. In case you were wondering, I do have rice as well. Dun, dun, dun. I actually had this yesterday, so I just went and heated this up in the microwave. Ooh, almost forgot. I need to take off all of these things. I'm just gonna leave the cherries and the pineapples like on the side. You know what? Never mind. I feel like the pineapples are gonna soak up all the juice, and I don't like pineapples. I'm not gonna eat them, so. I am gonna take them out and throw them out. I'm just now really realizing like how much work my mom, ooh, I need a bigger knife. How much work my mom like put in for cooking for our family. Like every single Sunday, she would throw down in the kitchen and this is a lot of work. I am like right now I'm feeling really tired. I mean, I'm excited to eat, but I'm really tired. <laughs> My mom, after she would cook a huge meal, I remember her saying that she would always be like, okay guys, I'm on strike, which means I'm not washing anybody else's dishes, I'm not doing anything else, leave me alone, don't bother me, I'm off. For the rest of the day, and now I completely get it. Like, this is actual real life work, and she would do this for us every single Sunday. Ooh, let's get into this mac and cheese dough. I'm very, very excited. Oh, ho, ho, look at that. Mmm. 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 Yes. I'm very proud of my mac and cheese. One more thing we cannot forget the jellied cranberry. I have to have this when I'm eating ham. It's just a must, okay? And if you don't eat your ham with cranberry, or if you don't like cranberry, I don't trust you. It's like the best part of eating ham, period. And this one is like, where's my ham? <laughs> Hershey, you ready for your ham, baby? <laughs> All right, Hersh, you ready? You ready, mama? She's so ready, come. Happy Thanksgiving, baby, mama love you. Slow down, Hersh, you're gonna make people think that I never feed you ever. <laughs> Look at her go. And you know what, she's gonna finish all of this and then she's gonna come and beg me for my food later. I bet you. Yummy! Ho ho ho, lick in the bowl! <laughs> Anyways, it's my turn for dinner, but of course we know a real nice special dinner is not complete without a beautiful glass of red wine. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep on pouring. All right, your girl is finally ready to eat. I'm looking crazy, but I'm comfy, I'm relaxed, and I'm really excited to jump into this food. I also got Bay here on camera. You know how we do. We're in a long distance relationship, so this is the best that we can do. And that's all we got, right, babe? We're feasting together. This is this is how we do. We pretty much do this like every night. <laughs> I'm really about to dig in now, y'all. So y'all don't want to see that. Y'all don't need to see that. So that's gonna be it for this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you in the next one. Bye.